Welcome to Vision Community's playthrough of Godus, uh, a very new green light game that's been let through. Um, for those of you who haven't seen it, it's based, or at least heavily influenced it seems, by the popular series. Um, this series of gameplay videos is going to take us right from the get-go with these two guys here uh, into, well, hopefully some form of civilization. Hopefully we'll get to that point, and it won't go to pot along the way. So, we've got these two guys here, uh, as we can see, everything's well, severely we'll go, uh, fog of war. Zoom in a little here, and we've got a guy and a girl. Seem to be having fun pickaxing this, so we're going to get some help. Going to get rid of that, and they're going to enjoy us. And we're going to get this card, which is a faith card, as you can see. It's what is used as power in this, as power in this game. You collect them in this book, and it allows difference. Uh, each card gives you a different thing. For this one, let's going to advance this here. This one we have here will give us more space to work with. Uh, it's going to go right here. You need to collect all four to go until the next period of your growth. At the moment, we're in very Stone Age. You can also want to get rid of this. And our first thing we got is uh, this house here. It's going to give some more help. Get rid of these trees get some more points down here which we can spend later on but not right yet so there we go we've got this so we've got another card here here's our new card which is a land expansion card right let's close this off and let's see how much space we've got to work with now oh. so as we can see we've got a lot more space but a lot more rocks but few clicks quickly gets rid of them and as you can see we now have the ability to build three houses. Click on this, it'll send one of them out and we'll get another build. Let's get rid of these trees while we're at it and let's uh, oh dear, let's try escaping the landscape a little and see if we can get another one in there. Go on. Come on. There we are. We can't get another one here so we send this guy out, build another house. And uh, uh, here come the timers. Let's get some more people to uh, worship uh, me. Yeah, let's get. Uh, can we get another one here? Yes, we can. Maybe one here. Go away. No. No, nothing there either. Okay, we don't think we can. Oh, oh, we can. We can get another one. Unfortunately, we have to wait. Um, while we're here, I will say that moving the. Uh, ground geometry there is very very awkward um, it's difficult at this point to go know which way it's going and I have frequently pulled it out and as I get through there if there's a building there it will completely destroy the building yep. let's set this get this uh, one on its way to build a new building for us and slowly build it up to get another land expansion card slowly as you can see up here, this is the uh, what we need to get, which is we need six population to get the next card. So hopefully we're almost on the way. Come on, build it up. Uh, again, we have to wait. So yeah, it's it's not as in-depth as some people may like, for example, those of you like civ Civilization. Um, oh, there we go. New card. One more land expansion card. And Smart Sculpting, which is very similar to what we have. It's... I'm going to show here. If I double-click here, it fills in the area. But it's very... I don't know. It's very hit and miss. I don't like it too much. If you click there, it will fill it out. If you right-click, it'll pull back to where you're clicking, which we don't want to do here. We want to fill this all out here. Come on, fill it out. Get as much space as possible. Quick double-click. But yes, back as I was saying, it's it's not as in-depth as those who like, say, civilization. Uh, you're never gonna. It's it's not it's not that in-depth game. It's the gameplay is nowhere near that much. It's very simple, but. It has a, a lot of simplicity to the point where it does start to become a little more complicated. Uh, try and push this back a bit more. 
and not go back into the sea. And as you can see, we've got more houses here. So we're going to send them all out whilst we go to ooh, accidentally destroy that tree with the land. And that one too. And I've, that can be uh, some sort of fishing post, I suppose. We should get rid of it. There we go. I'm also going to get rid of this land here. We've got a lot more houses. Oh dear. And we have another card. Ah, felt tense. Now, this will help, but we need to get some more resources. Let's have a look in there. Right, if you have a look at this, it doesn't actually say what you can use. Okay. Do we not get to look at that? No? Okay then. Alright, we need something, which it's not the town can tell us, to uh, unlock felt tents. Yeah, oh, luckily, we have a chest right here. A chest right here that gives us, unsurprisingly, felt to unlock felt tents. We're one step closer to uh, getting into the new age. Right, while we're here, let's push this back. And try and get some more as many houses as possible oh ah I've run out of oh dear I've run out get rid of all this as you can see it does use the resource down there which uh, unfortunately I wasn't paying attention to which now we've run out of it but we have a new card which is a further land expansion which means quickly do this. Oh, we have another chest. Ah, timber. Uh, that'll be used for something else later. Let's get rid of that now. Yeah. One thing I don't like, as you can see, is with how awkward it is to get rid of the land. A misclick can severely hinder your progress to the point where uh, I hope that maybe it's looked at. <laughs> And it's changed, but I don't know if it will be. There we go. Right, let's send everyone out. And let's get as many houses as possible out here. Oh, another chest. Oh, I can't. There we go. More timber. Always good for a start in civilization. And again, again, just accidentally spending more. Now as you can see these houses are a little bigger now because of more space available. Send these out. Which will come into play. And it's noted that these big ones can have multiple people working on it once to speed up the uh, production of them. If I just spam this out. Come on. You know you want to. Get rid of that in the process. Get rid of these trees. And we have another card. Ah, we have construction. Which is... We almost have enough for this. We have the two timber. There we go. Now we need to find some more felt. Let's try and expand that a bit more. See if we can make that. These two big houses. There we go. Maybe we can get one here as well. I should get rid of an... There we go. Right. Let's send all these lot off and start building more. Let's expand this out a bit as well. See if we can get some... See if we can't get some more houses. Ah, uh, see. Now that's a problem. There's one of the problems. I accidentally just completely destroyed the house whilst it was being built. Which is one of the problems I've been having with the whole... Ah, right. Let's let's be a bit more careful with that from now on. Send you out as well. Hopefully this felt this one will be finished soon. Maybe see some felt on it. Who knows? Uh, as we see up here, we have almost hit the quota to upgrade to the next one. So let's manage the land a bit more. Let's see if we can't get some more houses out here. Definitely the one that there we go. Yep. Go on. Yep. 
Alright, let's see if here as well. Got a lot of unused space here actually. Hmm. Now I think that should definitely be able to have one here. Let's try being a bit careful here. And sculping the land a bit. There we go. Alright, I know we've got a card, shush. Yeah. Send you off first. And then further land card is here. Uh, gonna stop this one here and we'll continue on and see how far we can get the civilization going. <laughs>